Agfinity is a full service cooperative uh, serving the front range uh, trade territory from Cheyenne to Colorado Springs uh, into the Pueblo area. Agfinity is a 110 year old company started in 1905 and so been around a long time. Um, we've uh, got uh, a membership base of over 3,000 members, row crop farmers and livestock producers and animal husbandry uh, folks are the primary core uh, common members uh, of our cooperative. And then our retail business, we have C-stores and outlets uh, such as Ace Hardware, uh, grocery stores and different uh, warehouses that we ship product from. We are a very diverse company, um, so very fortunate to be able to kind of dabble and work in a lot of different arenas on any given day, uh, but I got great people that uh, are very skilled in those areas, uh, know the business and are really entrenched and have great capital intellect in the people that work here. I think that uh, country's biggest concerns these days with the population growth that we're seeing across the globe, that feeding the people is my primary goal and to give the proper nutrition and that backs up into the sustainability of production of agriculture and doing uh, the right stewardship practices and business practices to optimize the profitability and the productivity of uh, an acre, plot, or even a square foot of the ground that we're entrusted with. Well, we're involved in the Boys and Girls Clubs, 4-H, FFA, uh, those traditional clubs. Uh, we're also reaching out, though, to teacher in the classroom and trying to educate the classroom or the teachers that are teaching uh, science and agricultural uh, practices to some of their, their students. And so that the next generation coming up, as we continue to move off the farm and into cities and rural areas, we're trying to educate those that are in the classroom that maybe will never step on a farm and will be in the city all their life about agriculture and how agriculture is operational today. And it's a long-term view. You got to start with the teachers and the kids so that as the generations come forward that they have some knowledge of the science and the precision and the stewardship that all goes into uh, agriculture. So agriculture has been through many challenges over the uh, decades and uh, I just feel so blessed with all that they have worked through and still have an entity that has lasted to the test of time.